Hi, my name is Mike Bachman. I'm a United Methodist pastor serving a new church start here in the city of Dallas called Union. And I've been invited by the Bayina Institute to come in and do an interview with uh, Imam Omar Suleiman today. We've got an uh, audience with us to, to be a part of um, our conversation. I'm really excited to have the opportunity to ask some questions uh, of the Imam. Uh, a lot of questions that I believe that um, Americans wonder about Islam. And I've had this realization over time that a lot of what I've been hearing about Islam recently are things that I've heard primarily from politicians and pundits and not actually from Muslims themselves. And I think that um, we need to have opportunities for dialogue and conversation uh, with Muslims uh, about their own faith uh, before we come to any sort of conclusion or, or, or beliefs as individuals, as a society and beyond. Uh, and so I'm really eager for this conversation to have the opportunity uh, to hear directly from a man who is well studied, is well respected, uh, and, and is a leader in uh, Islam here in uh, Dallas area and then also in the United States as a whole. So I'm really excited to get to spend some time with you uh, today. Appreciate it. Thank yeah, you for coming. Absolutely. Looking forward to it. Um, so uh, I'm curious, uh, we might as well just, just start, off, uh, start off well off the bat. Um, you know, it isn't that like Muslims just arrived in America. Sure. <laughs> um, Muslims have been in this country for a while. Like and, five years, right? Yeah, about five years or so, yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> so Muslims have been in this country for, for, for a long time, to, to varying degrees, of course. And, and I'm not that old in the grand scheme of things. I'm 37. Um, but I've certainly noticed over the past several years that um, there's been more and more uh, conversation around Muslims in America. There's been more anti-Muslim rhetoric uh, in recent times. 